Let's now shift our attention to the other big story that we are tracking on Vyond, where in some major updates in the Navalny's poisoning case, the Vladimir Putin's critic can finally speak again, according to a German political magazine. The Russian opposition candidate has made progress in his recovery after he was poisoned with what is being widely speculated to be a case of a Novichok nerve agent having been used against him. The Kremlin critic is currently being treated in Berlin's charity hospital. The German magazine also states that Navalny could remember the details of his collapse, although he's not spoken about it yet. The sources have mentioned that Navalny's police protection has also been stepped up and his condition is improving. The Navalny statements could spell trouble for Russia, which has been accused of targeting the prominent Kremlin critic. Meanwhile, Russia's President Vladimir Putin has told Italy's Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte that he'll be setting up a committee to investigate the poisoning of Alexei Navalny. The Italian Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte was quoted as saying, President Putin has assured me that Russia intends to clear up what has happened. And he's also told me that he'll step up. The committee set up a committee of inquiry and is ready to collaborate with the German authorities in getting to the bottom of the matter. Now, this comes as international pressure mounts on Moscow over the poisoning incident. The incident has escalated tensions between Russia and the West to new heights. Now, earlier, the U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo had said that there was a substantial chance that his poisoning was ordered by very senior Russian officials. Berlin has also been facing calls for a sharper response with some opposition politicians calling for the Nord Stream 2 gas pipeline from Russia to Germany to be cancelled.